Hey what is up everyone welcome back to a brand new video on the channel. Now for all you guys who don't know and have been living under a rock recently Leafy came back to this platform and uh, basically started making really funny short videos again that include a lot of jokes and also a lot of memes regarding Kim Jong Un. But anyways, in today's episode, we're going to be getting into a video where this YouTuber basically calls out Leafy and uh, basically goes on to say that everything about him was basically dog shit, which is honestly golden coming from this guy. But anyways, without further ado, let's get right into the video and see what this guy has to say about Leafy and YouTube as a whole. But before we get into the video, please feel free to leave a like down below and subscribe because it helps the channel grow so much and we're about to surpass 800 subscribers, which is honestly absolutely insane. But anyways, let's get right into the shits. Watch this. Oh, whoa. <laughs> A lot of people have been saying that they miss Leafy and they're just awaiting his great return. But I can guarantee to you that nobody actually misses Leafy. Yeah, uh, guys, no one at all misses Leafy. I mean, that's why his videos have been getting less than a million views lately. And that's why he's also been gaining just a meek 10,000 followers a day, which you know is easily attainable and just anyone in the world could get that amount. But anyways, let's see what else this genius has to say. Or should I call him the YouTube guru instead? Try to think of his positive traits. I can wait. Gotta love people like this that make it out like there's some sort of tier list of intellectual humor on YouTube, preaching their holy bible of good content and bad content, and every single time they list the same stupid shit. And really it just boils down to, this person or video just doesn't have enough effort put into it. And by effort, they mean overall just more quality in the video. The videos are overall more structured, the audio is better, the video is better, they're more planned out, the video should have a little bit more scripting, and overall the video should just have more time time put into it. There should be bulletproof ideas brought to the table, not just shit posts. I'll tell you what, if you want higher quality of content and this is your criteria for judging it, go turn on your fucking TV because anything on television is going to have an infinite amount of all of that. I mean, first of all, if no one gives a fuck about Leafy like this guy's claiming, then why waste your time making a complete video about him and why he's so trash? And also, I just find the whole situation ironic because Leafy's video about this guy posted just over a week ago already has 1.4 million views, which uh, clearly demonstrates that no one, absolutely no one in the world gives a shit about Leafy, especially upon his return to YouTube. And uh, honestly, in my opinion, Leafy's completely right in this situation. I mean, like, these YouTubers are making it out to be like YouTube some god tier fucking platform for making content where every video has the obligation to basically be structured and professional like television but at the end of the day it's called youtube for a reason it's because anyone can make videos with the click of a button and honestly people just want to come to this platform to relax sit back maybe watch some tlc and big ed exposed videos but at the end of the day, Leafy is right in my opinion. If you are at the end of the day critiquing other YouTubers for not achieving your level of quality content, then just go ahead and turn on your television because like Leafy says in the video, there are honestly an infinite amount of high quality production videos on TV. But anyways, let's see what the final part of this video has to offer. Many people saw Leafy's strategy as cheating in order to get to the top because he used the right keywords and thumbnails to get the click. Of course, this practice hasn't exactly left YouTube, but nobody has benefited from it quite like Leafy. I think he's mad, guys. Yeah, just a random guess. This guy's steaming right now, and... <laughs> You know what, if I was him, I'd be mad too. Go back to Starbucks and stay mad. Hey, what's next? What's that? What's up? Yeah. <laughs> and uh, yeah, that's basically going to wrap up the video where uh, Leafy basically says to this guy, go back to Starbucks and, you know, have some milk on the side. Maybe that'll make him feel better because he looks shook in the video and he's probably now more ever so shook because Leafy has made his return to the platform. 
But uh, yeah, feel free to let me know what you guys think of the whole situation. I personally believe that Leafy is completely right in this situation. Because at the end of the day, YouTube is a platform where you basically could create your own content and there's no level of standards which you have to abide by. And I think this is what honestly makes YouTube so great because literally anyone could just create content with a click of a button. But uh, yeah, I hope you guys all enjoyed today's video. If you did, please feel free to leave a like down below. Because if you don't, this guy that is extremely triggered at Leafy will make his next video completely exposing you and destroying your whole career. But anyways, I hope you guys all enjoyed today's video and I can't wait to see you guys all in my next video.